Hey everybody, it's Sandwedge. Welcome back. This is Nostalgia by My Old, and we are on map 9. Bleed me an ocean. Uh, I'd rather not, but uh, hopefully that doesn't come true in this one. However, it is teasing me a BFG rather early. That suggests something crazy could be afoot. Maybe that's a secret. I'm not actually sure. Looks like that opens possibly from the other side. So yeah. Uh, this is a great one to return to. I mean, it's, as the name suggests, it's, uh, fairly classic in nature, though it is limit-removing. Ah, a nice little, nice little gift there. I was, I was right to back up when I heard the imp parade behind me there. That worked out quite well. So, actually getting gifted quite a bit here, but, uh... Been a, been a little while since I played this. Um, so things have started to heat up a, a little bit. But uh, it definitely started off very, very accessible. Which is always nice. But of course, start making your way in a little bit. I mean, it's nice that it starts accessible because that means, you know, it's going to take a while for stuff to really ramp up too crazy. Oh no. Let's uh bait these guys out here and take care of the pain elemental. But yeah, we're already into sort of the Whoa. That was fun. Uh, I was wasn't hit by any lost souls. Uh we're into the heck basey stuff pretty early on, so you know, not not completely following the uh, ooh, the uh, kind of classic episode uh, progression. I like I like the uh, missing parts of the, the floor there. Looks cool. Oh, no, I'm glad I went over here first. I actually got the key for that. Uh, no ambush for that. We got a couple secrets. 77 monsters, not too many. However, I think there is more for me to explore somewhere around here, right? This is where I came from. Just before I use the key on the door, I'd rather kind of explore everything there is to... Which I think I pretty much did. Yeah, I... I'm a little bit... I have not played Doom in a bit, so let me let me just orient myself here. This, this cat goes... Kind of, it's kind of annoying when they lock the door that way, visually. Giving all the demons concealment on the other side. actually just played with a mod, so I'm like... Gotta get get into the vanilla stuff again here. Not this... I mean, vanilla gameplay, not the... Uh, obviously, the wad is limit removing. We actually got... This guy is taking longer than expected. He's dodging quite well, and I'm... Trying not to get hit by imps. Of course, this has a a nice uh, rollicking uh, Jimmy tune to accompany it. Nice. But yeah, so so far. Yeah, very visually pleasing. We'll still evoke in the classic feel. Um, lots of little... I mean, that's the fun thing about Limit Room. You can have all these little... These little details that you get to bump around on, you know? And, uh... I guess we did trigger the ambush, so... No need for the plasma. Actually, running somewhat low on some of this other stuff. So, where are we headed now? It's a, there's a one-way door over here. 
or one-sided wall anyway. I think I can, yeah, I can definitely like jump across there, right? That's definitely what that means. So, yeah. Nice, got some extra ammo. Not a lot of enemies left, so I should probably not be too afraid to use this plasma gun. Uh, also a little bit inf unfamiliar with this audio setup I have, so it's like you. I've, I've I've talked so long with one audio setup that it takes a little bit to like dial in and figure it out. But hopefully everything is working for you guys. Uh, nice out outdoor bridge area. It's it's actually nice that this went into the corrupted tech base so soon because with limit removing you can do so much. You can just like the extra line. Limits allow you to corrupt things really well, you know? One way of looking at it. Yeah. We, we, I still didn't use the plasma because there really wasn't... There really wasn't much that necessitated it. So... Yeah, that's... A, I guess we... <laughs> there was just a single bear in which... You know, we could just rock it, so. There's something down. That's that's just a teleport to get back up, I assume. Yeah. Missed a secret, but I got more than enough ammo for that one. Well, I did not bleed an ocean, thankfully. Creeping death. I'm creeping death. Doesn't sound like this is a creeping death midi. The Metallica song, I mean. But... I bet the name might take a cue from it. Ah, that guy's a real doll for giving me an armor. He opened up his little cell and was like, Here! Hey, Doom guy, I bet you could use this! There's a lot of hit scanners around the corner! Here you go! You like my... My New York Revenant. Well, this isn't Creeping Death, but, uh... I like it. The MIDI, I mean. Well... <laughs> That's a save right there. I'm locked. Yep, yep. Might as well try. I'm out of... Well, I can just... Yeah, yeah, there we go. That felt close, but I didn't really get winged, so... Well, I'd like that soul sphere. Oh, there's a couple of them bunched up, so... Where is that? There it is. Oh, I should have grabbed that shotgun shell before I went in there. Well. Thankfully, while it is heating up a little bit, it's... So far, just nice, nice and easy. Pretty... Yeah, you want you want to finish him off for me? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you could use some help there, Doom guy. There you go. Now you owe me. Oh, I didn't hear that splash. That was disturbing. 
Does this hurt? No. Good to know. This blood is perfectly fine. Uh, we'll have to. It remains to be seen whether all the blood will be fine. Wow. Okay. Quite generous. It's kind of a waste of a rocket. But I don't believe I have Berserk, so might as well shoot these guys. Okay. Great on health here. That blue torch did look out of place a little bit. I hear. Nice. Little stucco room in there, you know, a little secret stucco. Oh, all, all the little, all the little uh, alcoves are stucco. It's pretty. I will not make the same mistake as last map. I will use the plasma to its fullest. Might as well, you know. Why does this song... I don't know what it is about this song. I don't know what it's reminding me of. No, 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 no. Sounds like some kind of traditional. What is this? Uh, like a like an evil polka? I don't know. Wow. I got punched once. Now there was a BFG teasing me in that last one that I never got, so I guess now we're even. Uh, this, this is a few more going to open up here, huh? Nice. Okay, that was a little bit iffy on the timing there. Not going to lie. But, you know what? EFG, you can afford to be a little sloppy, and I had plenty of, uh... Plenty of health and stuff. Is there even a way to get back? Or is it, like, the teleport right here? Yeah. Uh, I spied something on the map with my little eye. Um... Right... You see what- do you see what I see? Wait a minute. That... There we go. Well, you know. That'll be very useful for my next pistol start. For sure. But really... Sometimes it's just nice to find the secrets if I do see them. Might as well. Just squeeze every last drop out of... the map. Okay, Rapture. Now, before I go into this... Okay, this is the last one of the first episode. The Tech Pace episode. I don't like it up there. I don't really like it... Any of this. Too much going on. Can't lower that. Squeezed by those cacos, thankfully. Oh shit. No SSG yet, which is concerning me. Ah, 
I uh, can't actually exit there. Okay, killing the spiders actually. Okay, some nice infighting and a plasma gun. Unfortunately, this gigantic dude is... Okay, he was standing right on it. Okay, this this seems to amp stuff up a little. This is a hot start and quite a bit of maneuvering. Fun, though. And balanced in such a way that I'm not necessarily... Like... It's... It's... Bracing, but it's not... You know, I, I, I've survived quite well, just with some rudimentary sort of uh, fire maneuver and identification of prioritization, indoctrination of our nation, you know, that kind of thing. I like to look at this, though. This is uh, clearly we're, we are on the verge of entering hell and out of the tech base episode because we're we've gotten to the this is what passes for a water park for demons i'm guessing oh fuck i missed that it would have been useful earlier but in my defense there's a lot happening all right now i feel like i'm in the groove that was a really nice map to to warm up make you make you have to you know really really pay attention and run around okay now I'm in it oh there we go beautiful classic classic texture uh, secrets you know your, your old your old favorite old faithful there's another one look at that nice intuitive Classic feeling secrets in a way, you know? Misaligned texture here or there, or a different texture, or... Sidle along an edge. All, the, all that nice stuff. Like, there, there's a bit of a different meta in secrets. I think, you know, just... Yeah, you know, everybody's seen all the classic secrets, but it's kind of nice sometimes to just... Kind of be given stuff. Anyway. We got lots of plasma in this one as well. Halfway through the monster count. Oh, I thought... Okay. Oh dear. Don't want him to res. No, he did. But okay, we got him. Thankfully, that wasn't too much revenant cover for that arch file. Because that is one of the scarier things. Okay. Can't <laughs> get over the blood hot tubs. Okay, we've raised that to get to the rocket launcher. Beautiful. Give me that. Okay, we got a nice stockpile of rockets now. But... I'd like to save them for whatever this thing is up next. Well covered down here. However, or something going to be following the imps in. I saw a mancubus fire, but this mancubus is just going to take out the trash for me if he decides to fire someday. Nice. That was a good time. Cool. Alright. And... That's... Did the Kakos come out of those... They may have come out of those, uh... Holes up there. Those are Kako holes if I've ever seen them. Well... Well, I mean, there are other Kako holes too, but I'm not 
talking about those. Nice, the big fun gun. Okay. Not a ton of monsters left, but... Oh. I don't actually know how to get that thing down. should try to leave more super shotgun for every fight just as a nice close-in finisher yeah there's some left off to? The red door. Oh, I see something. Did I go in there? Okay. Huh. Berserk pack. Oh, I don't really... I have a BFG, so punching stuff, I don't know. Really necessary. Why does that seem... Is that thing gonna open too? Doesn't that? That looks like. Why is there like a. The auto map? I don't know. I'm guessing there's gonna be something crazy at the end here. Cyber Demon, maybe, for the end of the episode? Oh yeah. Oh yeah! Get out of go! Uh, any more secrets? I'm not really... Oh, what's that? BFG room. Holds something of value. Potentially. Huh? Oh, yeah, you see that texture? Yeah. Sure, why not? Thanks for coming. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was... Wow, okay, I got him to infight at least. Nice. Surprised he actually took enough from them to actually get him in one blast. I didn't even... I, I didn't even... They did most of the work for me. I didn't even barely need to use the BFG on that one. Thanks, guys. That was a fun one. I actually got everything. Ouch. Is that a forced death exit? It might be, because we are on to episode two city. We're getting into the lion's den. Oh, baby. With the flick of a switch, the device powering the demonic portal sputters and dies. Congratulations, you won! You throw aside your weapons and begin the long journey home, only to find that the demons have begun attack. You know, it's like there's always more demons. I don't. Come on. How? What? Why can't you talk to the demon? Attacking the civilian population. How could this be? It's not fair. Time for some payback. It's a nice back of the box description there. All right. Oh, we see them all lined up there in uh, formation. They're, they're in standard formation. Little bastards up front, big ones in back. I think there were a bunch of Jimmy middies that I saw. Like, what's the midi for this one? It's, uh... Woe is... The world from Comic Zone? Oh, okay. That's different. 
Um, I didn't really want a single shot on this guy, but I kind of drew his ire. I want that. Um, I think stuff sees me, though, so... Uh, there's definitely stuff in there. Yeah. Thankfully, just a single revenant. You know what I like? It's got the typical Doom City thing of guys just, like, mounted in windows, but they're not too high up, so it's not that bad to auto-aim them, you know? We got a couple secrets. Sometimes our map can help us. What did that do? Oh. Stop shooting me through mid textures. It's illegal. Okay. Finally got to this little song and dance. No personnel. Huh. Nothing personnel, Doom Guy. Let's conserve some shotgun ammo. What? Jeez. Scared me. Uh... Before we fought, I mean, th this is, if you ever see a dark alley in the city with a health potions lead again, uh, don't go in there. Uh, that's, that's like the most basic mugging tactic I've ever seen. Yeah, that did look suspicious. Nice. Okay, we got all the secret. Was there anything else? around here. I don't think I've... Oh. Coming out of that collapsed cave there. I'm playing a lot of urban levels lately. Um, not necessarily always intended, but I'm just... The second episode of, of a couple of classic wads like Dominus Diabolus is a uh, city as well. And uh, I really like the style of like having the streets and then um, all the little buildings you can go into. And they all have their own unique take on it. Like this one... This, this one, I, I really like the streets in this, you know? They've got the sidewalks and the markings and everything. Very nice. Uh... Okay. I'm guessing there's going to be more coming in here, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shit. Yeah. That's tough. Oh, that's tough because... You're so scared of the splash damage with the with your newly acquired rocket launcher, but you want to use it so bad. There. That was close. I got whacked in the head a couple times, but hey. I have in real life too, and you just keep I just keep ticking. One time I fell out of a tree. I don't know if you heard that, but yeah. Pretty crazy. Have you ever seen a duck? Anyway. Alright. It's just a little bit of a gutter. Just a little bit of a, a blood alley. Okay, now we can go back. We've secured some explosive weaponry. Maybe we can even take on this mugger. <laughs> You ever get mugged by an Arachnatron? Honestly, I wouldn't even mind. I'd be like, 
Yeah, that's mess. I, I, I just like take my money. It's, it's, it's worth it. It's like I'm paying for a show. There's like an arachnotron stealing my money. Like, how would you even give him your money? Like, like in his mouth or would he have like a backpack? Cause you can't just put it in one of his hands. He's walking on metal legs. I don't know. Maybe I'm overthinking this. Oh. Uh, did I really explore this? Did I go in here? All the way? No, I didn't. I can punch these guys. Um, why don't we punch them before... Oh, another rocket launcher. Okay, so... That's actually quite nice. Uh, Non-linear level, but it, it gives you... Okay, I was wondering. It gives you the rocket launcher in every uh, path you take. There's actually a shotgun box I missed. So... So they haven't hidden, you know, all the, all the walls and stuff. So you can kind of... Honestly, you could use the auto map to scope out traps sometimes, and on a blind run, if you're if you're trying to do well, uh, it could help. I mean, certainly, uh, I mean, I I like just trying not to die within reason. I don't play saveless though, because if I do die, I don't want it to be too painful. But for Iron Man runs, that's a technique to. If we try to figure out what's going to happen before it happens. Um, yeah, I did get the secrets here, so... I'm not actually sure I've... Did that uh, thing just let me out? I don't know. Uh, I actually kid... Okay, no, I do need the, the last key. Not going to get off that easy. All right. Got a couple rockets, but I'm getting a bit more in here. However, like I said, these, it looks, oh, bit of a harm there. That might uh, be a s software port thing, but there it is. Um, I could just jump off here. Yeah, I could have just jumped off there if there was anything really scary. However, there's a, a monster left. Could be an arch vial. I don't hear it. Could be in the final room though. Ah, just the Baron boy. Yeah, no problem. Well, we got through the lines then, no problem. Up next, Sludge Factory. Now that, is that not an Alice in Chains song on the dog album? You know, Wilster Wonkle's favorite Alice in Chains album? Oh, jeez. I should have been talking. Oh, that got hotter than I expected. This is definitely not Alice in Chains. Midi, though. It's a little too happy-go-lucky. But I like that. I love that. Gotta love that funk bass. Yeah. So we went past the nothing personnel sign, I guess. So, so far, I'm liking this urban aesthetic. Everybody does it their own way. Of course, like most people, I wasn't the biggest fan of the urban levels in Doom 2. So it's nice to see getting bit there is not nice to see. But it's nice to see uh, people doing it. Just a little bit of extra detail makes it pop. Sure. I'll wake up stuff so I can get that that armor. Oh. Oh no, they've been growing cacos in these vats and I'm almost dead. No.
Oh, it was a nice little infight that we triggered there. Quite helpful to grab those med kids, if nothing else. Oh. Oh. He had his fun, and now he wants us. Look what happened. Okay. Oh, that one's blinky. You know what that means. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's gonna be useful, because I was actually... Struggling with some health issues there. <laughs> struggling with some health issues. That's a funny way to... <laughs> Doom guy's struggling with some health issues right now, you know. And he doesn't have all the insurance coverage he needs, so... He's just gonna have to find medikits out in the field, you know? Wouldn't that be a messed up story for, for Doom guy? I was just like... Yeah, he can't get medical care, so he actually just has to, like... Go to a... Go to a tech base that's under siege to, like, scrounge as many medkits as he can. It's the only way. Oh, look at that thin door. That's cute. I don't know UAC made it in ultra thin. Um, I could definitely... Could... Yeah, there we go. Uh, why is there a candle up there? Was that actually the intended way to get her? Can you, like... I think it was. But yeah, now I got 160 cells and a plasma gun. Okay, into the office space. Oh, we got a little pencil there. I love checking out all the little GameCube computers. A glass of water. Gee, that's cute. Uh, no uh, sexy mouse pads that I can see. Unfortunately. I mean, every office space will pale in comparison to that one. The candle. I don't know if you guys should be using candles in the office. It's kind of a fire hazard, but... Who am I to judge, I guess? Uh-oh, the boss is here. <laughs> Wish I could do that to my boss, right? <laughs> oh, that, that one was a different color. My new, propo my, my new modest proposal is to super shotgun the rich. <laughs> That's my take on it. My, my slight modification. You turned all the goddamn taps. The hell. We have a demon crisis and now we've got a drought. I hope this isn't in California because th these demons are going to be slapped with some pretty heavy fines. All right. Yeah. Wow. I'm getting a lot of Baron's infighting in this one. Quite nice. I haven't been that threatening, though. I haven't really been too confined with Baron's yet, which is mainly when they're actually dangerous. Oh, yeah. Uh, Plasma Gun might be better for these close quarters ambushes. Yeah. Get a couple of you in one. There we go. Yeah, we can splash a couple here. Nice. Uh, this is flowing really nicely, this level. I'm feeling it. The MIDI, you know, the MIDI probably helps. It just gets you in that... funky fresh... 
feeling. I don't know what I'm talking about. Gets you in that funky, fresh mood, you know? Okay, the pain on is not so much, but... There's actually a mo some monsters left, though. So we don't want to use all our stuff. Um... Okay, we need a yellow key. Yeah. So, where did we not go yet? We've got the... Okay, we got a red door that we can go to. Gotcha. Right there. Um... I didn't see the barrels there. That would have expedited things. No matter. That was that was fun. We've actually got all the secrets. Okay. Well then. Man, I should have looked for that secret on level. Was it one? Or sorry, no. The first the first one I did on this episode. I mean, I uh, think I missed some secrets, but so far I think I've been like a hundred percent. Oh no. Okay, we got the yellow key. Only one guy left. Well, look at here. Of course, of course, he made a beeline for that guy. He knew that was his only chance, but look at you now. Didn't do much for you. Alright. Sludge factory. Okay. Beneath. Why don't we try one more for today? It's not beneath me. Of course, we gotta dust the shotgunners as soon as possible. Nothing personnel, kid, but you gotta go. You blew it. Oh man. So many dopamine hits so easily in these maps. It's actually great. You just, you know, you, you do rudimentary exploring and you're gonna find the secrets. And you know what? Damn, it feels good to find a secret. <laughs> Damn, it feels good to find a secret. Nice little subway train here. I, I love how people are able to use vanilla textures to their fullest, you know? Like... Nice. Uh-oh. Nice. I'm actually fighting my way through the subway car. Didn't actually need the red key to get here. So I think I'm gonna come back. I might as well just keep going this way. Nice. Oh yeah. Here we go. I keep saying oh yeah like Luigi and I can't stop. I don't know why. Oh, I don't have the red. Beneath. Yeah, we're in a subway tunnel station. That's really nice. Uh, we do have the blue key. But... I, usually I like to explore elsewhere first. Because, you know... Usually the stuff that needs a key is going to like need more resources. At least that's how I would do it if I was designing bubbles. Okay, we got like a subway map. Figure out which station I'm supposed to go to. They gotta watch out here. I'm not sure where everything is. Oh shit! 
He lived a lot longer than I expected. Oh! Couldn't quite dodge in between. Oh! I thought I was going to dodge that. That was... Well, uh, we lived. Barely. Wow. That was exactly where I needed that. Nice... Uh, you know, nice inner city basketball court. It's not much, but it's ours. I think they're still using peach baskets. I don't know what it looks like. Okay, so I guess this is just a place to get your, your rocket launcher and such. You know, by the basketball court. Uh, did I just... What's that? What, what am I looking at? There's no window there. Whoa! Oh shit, they want to play a game of pickup. Yeah, you gotta you gotta watch some of those uh <laughs> some of those inner city basketball games, street rules. You ever try to play a basketball game with, with four guys with chain guns? That's fuck. Okay. Um why did we get Oh, is the red key get us to actually Oh, it's like that's like a different room. Oh, Hell yeah! I've actually been handing out the BFG rather, uh... Rather generously. Alright, well... Oh, you know what? This toilet's still clean. I gotta hand it to him. I just played a wad where all the toilets were clogged everywhere, and, uh... Quite nice to see that otherwise. Um... Needed to make sure he didn't spy us through that uh, window there. But yeah, I'll, BFG's always a nice way to just take those guys out quick and quick and easy. Yeah, I don't know. Some t so, you know, I do ride the subway sometimes, and. Uh, it's just one of those days, you know. Sometimes, sometimes the subway sucks. Like, this, is, this isn't even that far off. You got imps throwing fireballs. Oh, cool. Okay, this thing's been stuck here quite a bit. Someone actually burrowed out of here. I, I really like that, actually. You see the light coming out, too? Wow, we're actually making our way into the caves next to the subway. What a cool, what a cool, uh, way to do this level. Actually see a rocket down there. Oh. This looks great. I, I just have to remark when I just really like... Just the sense of place this is giving me, you know? This dank cave down here. Some cool light going on. Look at the torch light. It's actually shining on the ceiling. Um, this looks like it could be something. Yeah. However, I just realized... Okay, I mean, the BFG probably wasn't the right thing to use there. Because they were a bit dispersed, but I did use up all my cells. And didn't really use the BFG, but... Hey. Made sense. Arch file conductor, maybe? Oh no. Well... Makes sense. I mean, he's not getting around any other way, really, very quickly. Wow. That might be my favorite of the bunch, actually. I just... I I love the theme of that and how that was done. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it, too. Because that's going to do it for this episode. The Lotus Eaters will be next in the city episode. But uh, 
boy this is a real good one i, I i'm guessing i'm gonna see this nostalgia mega wad through it's hard to commit to mega wads but when they feel so good like this you, you got to make time for them so i will see you next time for more of that and for some other some other doom wads for sure uh catch you later